Hey, GED students, it's GED question of the daytime. And if you're reading this and going, um, is this a trick question? Uh, this seems so easy. No, it's not a trick question. It really is that easy. I just need to relate a super important concept uh, that's on the GED to something really simple that we understand. So let's take a look. It says, what is the distance? So I'm looking for a distance between four and zero on a number line. Okay. The distance between, well, four and zero on a number line. How far is zero from four? Well, you might be like, well, duh, isn't it four units away? Isn't that why we call it four? Yes, absolutely. The distance between zero and four on a number line is four. Okay, now I need to teach you something super important, though. <laughs> that has a name. The distance between a number and zero on a number line has a name. It's known as the number's absolute value. absolute value. And we have symbols for that. Um, the symbols for absolute value look like these up and down, straight up and down bars. Okay. So mathematically, if I wanted to ask this question in symbols instead of words, I would say, what is the distance between four and zero on a number line? That is what that means. If I say the absolute value of four, I'm saying how far is four from zero on a number line. And of course, as you just told me, it's just four units away. And so the answer to that would be four. All right. If you have any questions about this or any other GED math topic, be sure to drop it in the comments and I'll do my best to answer it.